Let the independent heart shine. Shine the light on the underground. Music Monday videos. Make it one day, here we go. So make it featured on the show. Sign up and get on your grizzly bro. You might have seen them on the road. With the camera and the microphone. Shine a light on independent hardest. Yeah, they gon' hate, we gon' get it regardless. Riding the hardest to get to the bag. Walking that Instagram class. Rowing that old duty bass. Shimmy, 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 yeah. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give more. Music Monday video. Music Monday videos. One exposure, there it go. There go, go, wanna make it here go. Music Monday videos, wanna get it there go, go, wanna spill you there go, go, wanna make it here go, go, there go. Music Monday, there go. Music Monday, there go. Music Monday, there go. Music Monday videos, wanna make it there go, go, wanna get it here go, go, wanna spill you there go. Videos, videos. O's, video O's, video O's, music Monday, video O's, video O's, give me, give me, give me, mo, one exposure, there you go. What's going on, guys? It's your man, Big Veg, your Rockerazzi Media Ambassador. There's something real serious. Music Monday videos. You know what time it is, okay? Because the weekend just passed, so, and it's Monday. That means it's a new, another dope episode for Music Monday videos as we continue to shine the light on independent artists and industry professionals. Coming off of that separated video with my man, my man, L.A. What's up, my brother? How you doing? Hey, what's good, bro? How you feeling? I'm blessed, King. How you doing? Can't complain. Can't complain. You out here doing your press run, do, doing what you do? Bro, trying. No, uh, no, no, you're not trying, you're doing. Take that out of your trying, vocabulary. All right, trying, not do, or doing, not you're, trying. My bad, my yeah, bad, you, my That's bad. what I'm saying, you know, because you're doing, because you're here, right? I'm here. I'm just saying. Alive. I'm saying. Absolutely, you're alive. <laughs> that, I hear that. Um, Absolutely, man. Um, You know, Aura 3 is out. Or three is out. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So definitely make sure you make sure you, you go that. get that. Yeah. That's the newest project out. But we want to start from the beginning of the whole story because um, it's important, man, that people know your story. You know what I'm For saying? Sure. Sure. Um, originally born in um, North Dakota. North Dakota. Yeah. But raised in Atlanta. Atlanta. Yeah, yeah. I want to exactly. make sure that people know that people think you grew up there. Right, right, but right. But let, let's make it clear, right? Right, right. Exactly. So, so yeah, I mean, my pops was military. So that's why we was in North Dakota at okay. the time, yeah. Okay. But I only spent like four or five years there, my first four or five years. Right. And then I was off to Georgia after that. So, right. Okay. Uh, yeah. So, I mean, that was kind of like the little upbringing. Right. Georgia. How was it? How was it growing up in? Um, it was you know? cool. I mean, we kind of moved to different areas in, um, in Georgia. My family, my parents originally from Savannah. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, yeah. So that's where they are from. So we were there. We was in Macon, Warner Robins, and then ultimately I ended up in Atlanta. So, gotcha. yeah, that's kind of like the whole thing that's, that's what's up man and, and and your name stands for something that's very dope i mean go ahead and go bro it's, yeah no uh LA. it means something real serious it's something serious man. yeah Talk nah, to it's, you, dog. That, uh, it's an acronym it stands for every life has an ending mm. and it's just like something i use as like a, a moniker or like some type of inspiration to kind of like live Keep every it going. day yeah live every day like it's the last and right make sure you especially know you, these days king yeah it's you know what i'm saying been like, crazy last couple of years so yeah especially last year, <laughs> last year right exactly so so know. yeah living that or you know living by that has been like my whole thing that's what's up so yeah um let's start the, the journey in the music like how did you get started i know it started when when you were young yeah so let's talk about that you know what i'm saying yeah no i mean um it started when i was in high school my friend came to class with a cd right? oh, okay and it was him rapping on some beats. Oh, okay. And I'm like, yo, what? at that time, studio equipment was, it was like, a bajillion, right, fulfilling, like, gazillion dollars. Money, right? <laughs> so I'm like, dude, I don't know how you're doing this. So, right. you know, I go to the crib. I, I meet up with him at his crib. Okay. And, and he had like a little USB mic he bought from Walmart. Oh, wow. And like a program that he like hacked or like oh, okay. cracked or something. This you know is what definitely what like, yeah, this is this, like this back, back in the day, day before, because sure. everything is accessible this now. It's like LimeWire day. Oh, LimeWire. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Continue. Yeah, proceed. No, proceed. So he, so he did. You know, he allowed me to jump on like a little beat we threw on. So you recorded for the first time, first time in ever, your whole yeah. life, and, and the first time I heard my my speak my 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 your voice, voice coming out of speakers, speakers, you I, fell in love. I was like, "Yo, this is it. It's what this you want to do." Crazy, yeah. So That's I mean, from that point on, it was just like, "All right, well, let me get that cracked version of that program." <laughs> right, right, right. And I'm gonna go get my USB mic. Let me, let I me, just, let me, let me go on LimeWire. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> 
exactly. So, or, 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 or Kazaa. Whoa. <laughs> yeah, I'm from that Share Eric Bear. I'm from that. I'm from that Eric King. Crossfire. <laughs> yeah. Nah, for real. So that's I mean, up. that's pretty much where the, where the start was. Started, and, right. And then from that point on, I just you know kept at it, just right. making songs every day. Mom kicking me out of the room. I was recording in her room. Oh, so, so Mama yeah. wasn't with it. Nah, she was like, you gotta get. Out you of gotta my go, room. dog. Like, so, what are you doing? That was where the computer was. You know what I'm saying? So, but yeah, I mean, at the end of the day, that's kind of where the start. That's where it started, and okay. then from that point on, I just was just honing in on the craft, you know, right, just right, trying right. to sharpen and sharpen that craft a little bit as much as I could. And Dope, man. From that point on, you know, and I'll, and, 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 and and not to cut you off, I know mm-hmm. I know one of your one of the dopest inspirations to get you flowing into it was Pharrell. It did, yeah, and for uh, sure. front and the front and joint, yeah, right? For sure. Talk about that, bro. No, I mean, I was Pharrell like, was just so cool in the yeah, video. It, it's so like. You, 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 you had to follow suit. Right, he's the <laughs> coolest. And at the time, it was like everybody was on like the gangster way, so niggas was right. Just everybody's like, hardcore, yeah, bro, bro, gang, gang, gang. Like, exactly. So from that point, I'm seeing Kanye come out, right. Lupe come out, right, right. Oh, and Lupe, Pharrell, yeah. Where these guys that just didn't care about that, they just wanted right. to be themselves yeah, and, and be cool, be smooth, be, cool, yeah, be smooth, like laid the, back, the polos and the skateboards and all of that. You know, that's what's up. Which was just like that was like this is up my alley. You know right. what I'm saying? So. He was just one of those guys that I looked at and just immediately became drawn to as like a inspirational figure. Dope, S- especially musically. Yeah, so. yeah. I see you wearing a lot of. Um, I see you wearing the, the the Star Trek shirt in all your interviews or most of them. Yeah, I, so, I wear the, the Nerd hat. Right. Uh, yeah. Yeah. I yeah. Got actually, ice cream I, on right I, now. I, I, I saw. I saw the video where you doing that the food joint. Oh, right, 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 right. I'm yeah. like, yo, my brother tasting all the foods and stuff. I'm yeah, like, bro, really? Yeah, it was crazy. Yeah, I, I see. I, I, yeah, I can I tell by your facial right, expressions. Yeah, it was wild. I was like, what am I doing here? <laughs> what a, you're tasting yeah, your food. Right, exactly. <laughs> what you're doing? But that's yeah, bro, up, yeah, got the ice cream on now. So okay, yeah, you know, I'm up, super man. like, I'm just in tune with like Pharrell and whatever he has. It's uh, Shout out, shout out, shout out to Star Trek. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Um, talk about the deal, Atlantic, right? Um, yeah. You know, let, let's first off, let's talk about how you got the deal mm. and why you chose the deal. Because right, you know, we're in an era where being independent is the thing. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So why did you go major? But first, let's talk about how you got the deal okay. with, with with Atlantic Records. Yeah. So it was through the first Aura. So Aura Three just came out. Right. Uh, recently, right. and the first aura came out in like 2015. 2015, Yeah, and then from that point on, that was an EP it, or it was an EP. Yeah, oh, right, it right, was just right. something I threw up on SoundCloud. Right, just to throw like, yo, I'm yeah. here. And Holla I, yeah, at me. this right. is right. I, yeah. Like, because I had been putting singles out on SoundCloud right. up to that point and right. garnering like numbers mm-hmm. and stuff. Right. But I wanted to show people I could put a body, a, work a whole together, project right? together. And right. That's what aura was for me. Okay. So Okay. That first body of work was the one that like I got the label's attention. So Interscope was coming. I think um, you know, I had a meeting with them. I had a meeting with um, it was a lot of them. It okay. was, uh, but yeah, Atlantic was of those Atlantic. bunch, and, and you chose Atlantic. Chose Atlantic, yeah, and, okay. and it was through conversating with like Kaylani, oh, okay, who, which was the reason why I had signed at that time, because um, she was on the label. Shout out to the queen. Um, okay, and yeah, I mean, oh. from that point on, I was like, all right, I'll give it a try, and. Yeah, so that's kind of how that all happened. So, so how was it signing? How was it being on a major label? I mean, now this is your first, pro- your, you know, your first time signing to a label, mm-hmm. and now they're going to be pushing you. You have the, you have a machine pushing you. Right. So well, how so how is that whole experience? <laughs> like like for independent artists that want to get in the game, they want to get signed, they want right. to be famous and all that. You've been you've been in the game. Right. Signed now. to a major label. Yeah. Let's talk about that. So no, I I, I signed in 2015, or right. 2016, I think one of those years, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and then um yeah, I was expecting things to. To the, take off, the pop like ball, the machine, crazy. The machine to like start start machine, running, right? Right. but it didn't. You know what I mean? Like it was okay. one of those things where, you know, you expect one thing, but it's a whole different thing. Mm-hmm. Um, and that's why I I encourage anybody or any artists that are looking into a deal. Right. If you don't have an advocate in the building, mm. someone that's going hard for you, right. and that's going to run in those those rooms and those different offices, right. To to vouch for you, right then it, you might as well just stay independent. You right. know what I mean? Because right. I, I didn't have that with my first deal with Atlantic. I didn't really have a, a okay. champion in the building. You know right, what right. I mean? That had your um, back. That had my back right. and, and, and wanted to see me succeed right. um, at least to the point where they would do anything to, to see it happen. Right. To, to um, make sure that you won. Right, exactly. Right. I didn't have Because that. the label, they're they going to win regardless. Yeah, they, they, like, you know what I'm saying? Bro, they don't care. Regardless, they, that's, they, that's they, what I'm saying. They sign yeah. artists and they do their thing to, to kind of you know, that's they make money. They, they 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 push you to make money for them. Right, exactly. That's the that's so, the that's the initial goal. Right, and right. if you don't have somebody in the building to, to champion you, you don't have right. 
somebody that's going to push you to that next level. You'll right. stay stagnant, which is where right. I had, what I had to go through. Right, when which and you had you took a little break yeah. from social media, from the mm. business to kind of get yeah. your mind right. Right, right. So I um, said that that yeah. whole situation with Atlantic went. Um, we severed that last year, the beginning of 2020. So you're not signing with them currently? No, 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 no. Okay, now okay. I'm on Capital and Motown. Oh wow. So, okay. Yeah. So that that's how that happened. I I broke off from them. You know, it was a mutual a mutual agreement between both parties uh-huh. to just go ahead and like go our separate ways. Gotcha. And you know, the end of 2020 is when the Capital and Motown situation happened. Mm. That's where we are now. So, yeah. so we could say what the beginning of the pandemic. Was the end of the first relation, the first the label. first deal, yeah, right. And then, um, you know, I was I was independent pretty much all of 2020, right, until the very end of it, or like at least close to the, you know, ha- like the end of it or whatever, right, right. right. And then you went into and then I went into capital, the, yeah, to the capital situation. Wow, yeah. that's what it is. Um, let's talk about your artistry, bro. You you rap, you sing, um, you know, um. You know, talk about your artistry as far as your music. Like, if, just, just in case there's people that's tuning into this interview and they're tapping to you for the yeah. first time, describe your style. Yeah, so, I mean, I, I, I'm more of, like, a, just a more transparent artist. I like to kind of just put a lot of the situations and experiences that I've been through mm. in my music, and that comes in all different types of for, form. So that it could be rapping, it could be singing. Okay. Um, and then the production varies, too. It just depends on what, you know, I'm feeling at, <laughs> that day. At the time, right, yeah, right. But, at or that, the, moment. That, that moment, I'll say, in, right. in my career. Cause that's right. Um, but yeah, it's pretty much because emotions change. Yeah, exactly. You know, we're human, right? Right. And also, <laughs> right. like the sounds change as right. well. So right. you know, that's just what happens over time. You know, people, the sounds and the the instrumentals, they 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 change. So yeah, I mean, that's what you should expect when you, when listening to them. Listening to my music is just transparency. Sometimes venting, you know. Mm. Sometimes just because music could be uh, what's it? Music can be therapeutic. Therapeutic, you know definitely. What I'm that's what music is really for. And I think that's where um, a lot of my fan base came from. Is mm. you know just speaking of real, finding therapy through the music. You know, gotcha. and that's kind of where. Okay. Are. Yeah. Let's quickly talk about um, Aura Three. What are they gonna yeah. get when they hear Aura Three? Same thing, man. I think um, you know with Aura Three and just the Aura series in general. It was just it started about a, a broken relationship and mm. just. You know, from that point on, just the experiences that led right. through it. And I just wanted to kind of, like, every time you hear an aura project, you'll probably get that from it, you know. Right. And, and of course, your evolution. And the evolution of just being a man and, and the situations and how you're dealing with those things through the music. Gotcha. Um, okay. And yeah, so yeah, that's what you oh, should expect. And they can get that now. That's out now. That's out now. Aura okay. 3, all platforms. That's what's yeah. up. And where can they follow you? Uh, L-A, E-L-H-A-E. That's where I'm at, everywhere. Because L-A thinks people going to put L-A. Right, exactly. <laughs> you got to spell it out, E-L-H-A-E. spell the name because that's yeah. important, Kim. Every life has an ending. <laughs> there yeah. you go. Yeah. All right, cool. And in my city. My city. We're going into this video. Um, Brother, one million plus. Yeah, we just hit a million on, on, on YouTube. In that's, a month. Yeah. Congratulations, blessing, my brother. Man. Thank you so much. I um, really appreciate that. Tell us the, the thesis quickly before we get into the video behind the video because mm. you, you got the golf thing going on. Yeah, you, you, right, you, you, right. You, you know what I'm saying? Right. Like, like why, why, why golf? Like, well, <laughs> why is that the, 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 the whole thing with, with this video? So, I mean, I, I um, kind of left it up to my creative director and the director of the video right. to kind of, like, gear me in, or, like, you know, put me in the path of where they felt like it should go. It should go. So right, right, right. I was very open to... Okay. This record, because this is more of one of those feel good records. Mm, so I felt that, yeah. I was more like open to what they had to say. And, you know, the golf thing was like a cool little thing that they decided right. to come up with. And, and I it's was featuring an it. artist, too. Um, yeah, Masego. There you so, go. There you shout go. to Masego. Shout out to that homie, man. Yeah. All right. Last thing, man. Get some advice to those that are watching. You've been signed, we, we st- still signed <laughs> to another label. You right, know what I mean? Right. You've been independent. You've been, you've been major. You know I'm what I'm saying? Seasoned. You, right, there you go. <laughs> For those that are watching, give some, to, give some advice to those up and coming. Yeah, I mean, I think at the end of the day is following your heart, doing what you want to do as far as, you know, whatever you want to say, figuring out what you want to say as an artist, who you want to be as an artist, what you, what you want your mission statement to be. You know, those are things you should think about instead of just going straight to the studio and recording, ask yourself, what do you want to be known as, mm. you know? Um, and then experimenting, you know what I mean? Experimenting with different beats, different topics, different, different sounds. Different sounds. And, and then, you know, whatever you feel like sticks to you mm. and who you are, run with it. And then, you know, stick to that. On that note, we're going to get into it, man. My City featuring who? Masego. Masego. Shout out to Masego. Oh, it's something real serious, man. Yes, sir. Yo. Music Money Videos. I'm your man, Big Veg, L.A. Yes, sir. Yo, keep it locked. Let independent heart shine. Shine the light on the underground. Music Monday Videos. Make it one day, here we go. Sonic 
get featured on the show Sign up and get on your grizzly yo. You might have seen them on the road yeah. With that camera and the microphone Shine a light on independent hardest Yeah they gon' hate we gon' get it regardless Riding the hardest to get to the bag Walking that Instagram crash Rowing that old duty bass Shimmy 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 yeah Gimme 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 mo Music Monday video Music Monday videos One exposure there it go Wanna get it there it go Wanna make it here it go Music Monday videos Wanna get it there it go Wanna expose it there it go Wanna make it here it go There it go Music Monday 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 videos Wanna make it there it go Suppose a day go Videos 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 Music Monday Videos Videos Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give a moment One expose a day go